today we have October beauty boxes. I get three. I get Allure beauty box, Ice Cream Beauty, and BoxyCharm by Ipsy. I will have the prices of the subscriptions listed on the screen as well as the individual products. The only box that has sample sizes is the Allure. I do not put the equivalent of what it is. I just put the price that they have listed for the full price. But I do let you know if I am showing you a full size or a sample size. So let's go ahead and get into the Allure box. This is Allure right here. I mean, obviously, but I'm telling you anyway. This is the inside of the box and what that looks like. They always come with this brochure up here. Sometimes it has some random stuff. I don't, I, in all honesty, I don't really look at them. But uh, the little brochure here has the presses and the products and stuff listed on the inside. So I find that incredibly useful. So the first thing we got here is, I can never say this name, so I apologize if it doesn't come out right. It's Ol Harris skin. I'm sure that's not right. But anyways, it retails for $35 and this is the full size. Okay, so this this is what it looks like right here, but the, yeah, this is supposed to help with dark spots and um, helps your skin glow and all that stuff. I do love a good toner, so I am happy to try that. Okay, the next thing I got here is Florence by Meals. This is Glow Yeah Lip Oil. I have used these lip oils before and I absolutely love them. These retail for $16 and this is full size. Oh, this is a beautiful peach color. I love peachy colors. I feel like that looks really good on my complexion. Right, the next thing we got is from Skin & Co. This is Sicilian Light Serum and this is again full size and this retails for 60 bucks. And that is what the tube itself looks like. So the next thing we got is from Mealy. I don't know much about this brand, but it, I, this is a pretty generous bottle. This is Rosemary Mint Clarifying Sugar Sculpt Scrub. I am definitely going to give this a try because it's always good to clean your scalp. Uh, the rosemary mint is usually really good for helping hair growth. So this, I am interested to see how well it does. All right, the next thing we got is Curology. This retails for $12 and this is full size. This is a gentle cleanser. I don't really need this. I have plenty of cleansers that I'm currently using. and. I think I'm just gonna pass this one on. Okay, so this is Leaf Aqua Balm. Uh, this is a sample size. The full size is 15 milliliter, and this is just five milliliter. The full size retails for $32. Um, this, yeah, definitely gonna give this a try. I usually like these samples when traveling and that sort of thing. Um, it's just convenient, and I don't have to worry about using losing the big one. But yeah, uh, I. I'm excited about this guy. So the next thing we got is Olay Cleansing Melts. Uh, the I guess this is this is a sample size. Sample size has 12 dissolving pads, and the full size. Oh no, yeah, no, this is sample size. So the full size retails for nine nine. 99 and it has 32. I feel like this kind of product would be really good for traveling. I don't know that um, I would use this in any other circumstances. It's not really for me, but it could potentially be good. And there is a surprise last thing in here and it doesn't have the price on here. Um, I'll look it up and put it on there, but um, this is Liquid IV. I have used these before. These are excellent. I highly recommend these. All right, we are moving on to the next beauty box, which is Ice Cream Beauty. This is what the inside of the box looks like. And it looks like uh, they usually have um, packaging peanuts in there. I always empty it out. Um, but it looks like their theme this month is for breast cancer. It's got the whole pink theme. Okay, so the first thing we got here is Beauty Moon Cosmetics and Ice Cream Beauty Hope and Bloom Palette. And this here 
This retails for $35. Let's see what the colors are. Okay, so these are super pink. I have a lot of pink palettes right now, so I think I'm going to put this into the uh, bin for giveaways. So this is a little palette from Kianto Beauty. This retails for $20. And this is duochrome. That is what it looks like right there. I already like these. I haven't swatched them yet, but I'm gonna swatch them because like these, in, in here you're not gonna really see how great it looks. And I'm definitely gonna be using this. So there are the colors. You can kind of see the shine. They're really light, really pretty. These will look really pretty over solid colors that are matte and stuff, so I'm really excited about that. I think, I think these are going to be really pretty and fun to play with. Okay, so the next thing we got is Amped Plumping Lips. I think those are Amped Plumping Lip Oil from Indie Beats. This retails for $17. I don't typically use a lot of lip plumpers. I don't really need it. So I think this might go into my bin as well. Yeah, that's gonna go into my bin. I'll give away the suit. I, I really don't need lip plumpers. And so the next thing we have is Moon Slice Beauty. This retails for $19. This is a liquid blush. And I've really gotten into liquid blushes lately. I actually really like them. I like the way they wear. This is a really nice color. Okay, so I don't really see the name on here, but we're gonna swatch it and see what it looks like on my skin. Okay, this is it swatched. I'm gonna try to see how it looks. I think that's really, really pretty blended out like that. And I think it goes really well with my fair complexion as well. So yeah, I'm excited to create stuff with that. Okay, so the last thing in this is ZC. And this is a liquid glitter eyeshadow, and this retails for $24. I don't know how I'd feel. Let's see what color this is. Oh, this is super pretty. This, uh, see if I can get the shininess to show up. There you go. That is really, really pretty. Oh, so this, this is a liquid liner, so I didn't expect that, but that's what it is. I have to put a little bit more on there so you can see it. So you can see the liquid liner there, so that would look really pretty by itself under the eyes, or if you just want a little sparkle around your eyes, or you can use it as a topper on top of the other liners. Either way, it's super pretty and glittery, which I love glitter. Last box is BoxyCharm by Ipsy. So this is the box. This is the inside and let's get into it. So this one doesn't have anything for me to read to you, so I will find the prices and list them on here. Uh, the first thing we got here is Eloise Goddess. This is, I'm not sure what kind of palette this is. Okay, so this is an eyeshadow palette. These are the colors. I'm gonna swatch this one because I think I'm gonna use it because these, it's, I like the color story of it. It's slightly different. Uh, I don't know that the colors are unique to my collection, but I like the color story and I think it's pretty, so let's swatch it. Those are the color swatch. This one's pretty neutral and um, matches my skin tone, but there is a shade there. Um, I do like these. I feel like this is very wearable for every day or you can darken it for night, whatever. But I think these are really pretty. Oh, the next thing we got is Makeup Forever Mist and Fix 24 Hours. This is the box right here. I've actually been running low on my um, finishing sprays. This is what the bottle looks like. It is a plastic bottle, but I mean, it's fine for me. Okay, so this is a color contour palette. I'm not really sure what that says. The reading's a little funny for me, um, but I'll have it written down when I go look it up. Okay, this this cover on here is super cute. I do like that. This is nice. Okay, so I see what it is. It's like you, you, your contour, your blush, and your highlight. And I feel like this is going to be a good travel palette, so I'm going to keep it for that purpose. Not that I plan on going anywhere soon, but I like to have things available when I 
do go somewhere. Okay, so we have a serum from Tula. This is 24-7 Hydration Triple Hydra Complex Day and Night Serum. That is the box. I have used this brand before and I really do like this brand. They really make wonderful skincare. Oh, well, this is different. It says it's got probiotics and superfoods in this, but I don't know if you can see it. I'm trying to get it to show, but I don't know that it is. But there are like a bunch of little tiny balls in there. I'm super curious about that, but yeah. Well, that's a little balls. Okay, so the last thing we got here is Seat London. This is Glass Glow Skin Tint. Okay, so this is what the thing looks like. I feel like this would be a good outdoorsy thing to use. Um, I'm not really sure how I feel about this. I feel like, well, maybe not outdoors, but if you're like low maintenance, low makeup, I feel like this might be one of those things. I'm, I'm gonna have to play around with it and see how I feel about it. That is it of my beauty boxes. Let me know your thoughts down below and what you think of these boxes this month and the items in it. Let me know if you wanna see a review or a look with anything that I got and I will get that to you anyways. If you like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you want more content like this, please don't forget to subscribe. Otherwise, I'll see you in my next video.